Hey, this is Toto Bravo, and we're out here at the range. We've got our Hungarian parts kit from uh, Century Arms, uh, our AK-63 DS. We're going to put some rounds down range with her today. We're going to shoot uh, at 50 yards for best accuracy. I've never done that with this rifle, so that's what we're going to do today. That's enough yapping. Let's put some rounds down range. Let's uh, let's get our first rounds down range with the AK-63 DS. And we're going to shoot for uh, the best groups we can. So watch your lane. All right, let's go down range and check it out. It looks like our point of aim was way down here, but it most certainly looks like we at least, ah, no, that's an old round there. I don't know. I'm gonna be completely uh, up front here. I have no clue where those rounds went unless these are them right here. One, two, three, four, and five. We'll mark those just so we know. So I think maybe we're that far off to the right. Wow. We may have to drift that front pin or that old front sight post. Let's uh hmm. let's do another group. What we'll do is um we'll change our point of aim to over here. Let me hold on, I'll mark something. Okay, that's what I've done. Made this black box. I'll put my point aim here, see if we hit over here. That way we'll, we'll know for sure what kind of adjustment we need right, to make. So this will be our second series of five. We're going to try to determine our point of impact. We've moved our point of aim. So uh, let's see what we come up with. Watch your lane. Okay. So we aimed here and we impacted to the right. So one, two, three, four, and five. We're a little bit all over the place. Could be me though. But at least we know we move we need to move the front sight post to the right. Chase rounds. So let's do that. We've made a front sight post adjustment. We move the uh, front sight post to the right to chase the rounds. And uh, let's uh, fire another group of five and see where we end up. Here we go. Well, my point of aim was here, and we certainly moved. So point of aim was right here. 
and our impacts are obviously right here. One, two, three, four, and five. So there's that one. Now we're shooting a little low, but it looks like we need to bump, bump it over to the left just a hair and bring the sight up. All right, let's go our final five for the day. We're gonna aim at the top of the circle. We're gonna go back to our battle sight setting. Watch your lane. All right, final trip down range. Let's go check it out. We got it all sorted out here. So we had changed our point of aim this series to here. And we ended up here, not bad. So, so that whole final series of rounds was a little bit to the right. So we need to bump that front sight post just back a little bit to the right and <clears throat> chase it. I think we're good. Down rain. That was our bonus set of five. I think we got one, two, three, four, maybe, somewhere in there, five, not bad. So it definitely looks like we moved over quite a bit. I think we'll leave it there. All rounds complete. Let's go take a look. This is that last series of 19 or 20 that we shot. So I'm thinking it is all of this. 
with maybe a little, a few outliers, but that's the majority. So I'll take that. Left and right's fine with me. I just need to move the front sight post up so we can get center mass. If we were, if we move the front sight post up, I'd be extremely happy with that group. That's fantastic. AK-63DS. All right, we are wrapping up our range visit today with our Hungarian parts kit. Build AK-63DS. Uh, I had to make several adjustments today. We still need to make a, bring the front sight post up. I didn't have the proper tool, but as far as left and right is concerned, we are right where we need to be. Um, the rifle shot extremely well. Uh, no malfunctions. Everything uh, we shot through it uh, did as it should do. Fired and ejected. Uh, the weapon held together very well. Um, I would be telling a huge fib if I told you it was a pleasure to shoot. It's fun to shoot, but uh, this right here on the old cheap, uh, it's okay. And uh, you can still shoot very accurately. It's, uh, it's just not part of my top 10, but it's fine. So just being honest. Uh, the hookup between your shoulder and the rifle you do, using the... Uh, the folding uh, stock is fantastic. This stock is solid. And I said that in the other video. This thing is solid as a rock. But this was a lot of fun to shoot today. It shot very well. It is accurate. Um, we won't know exactly. I mean, we, we, we held a pretty good group down there. Uh, once I get the front sight post pushed up a little bit, um, our next step, we'll get this out to 100 yards and uh, see what we can group then with everything uh, kind of tuned in the way it's supposed to. And we'll go from there. But uh, very happy with this. Very happy with uh, the way it's shot. Uh, it's a really nice AK. It's sexy. It's good looking. It's very nice. And it seems to be very well built. So until proven otherwise, uh, that's what we're going to go with. So this is Toe 2 Bravo. I appreciate you watching. And uh, until I see you at the range again.